What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Today I'm going to be discussing another brief in Egyptian mythology. Today I'm going to discuss Thoth. So Thoth is the god of the moon, patron of the arts, science, hieroglyphics, speech, and wisdom. So he's been kind of known for a lot of the educational kind of things. He's also depicted as a man with an ibis head, or just as an ibis itself. And the Ibis is sacred animal to Thoth because they are also associated with the moon. Thoth has been called the Heart of Ra, Lord of Divine Words, and self-created whom none have given birth, God One. So, and wrap it all up, he speaks for Ra a lot of the times. Divine Words, he's the god of, you know, speech and wording and the hieroglyphics. And he was considered one of the like it would be considered like an old god where they kind of created themselves not like like they had other parents like see other videos of mine he's an important god in the egyptian mythology because he is believed to be the author of the book of the dead which is a very sacred book to the egyptians especially on that era with the resurrection and the afterlife and everything like that he's the author of it He's also regarded as both the heart and the tongue of the great sun god Ra, and he spoke for the wishes of Ra, which I said previously, but that's just another point to add on. Like, he would speak to the people for Ra. Uh, Thoth also granted life to the dead for millions of years, according to mythology on that. And, uh, he's also been a, a part of the judging process after the weighing is done, Thoth tells the soul whether they're going to go to the afterlife or be damned and have their soul eaten. Which is, sounds pretty harsh, but that's what the Egyptians believed. And during the great battle between Set and Horus, Thoth acted like a judge. And the, uh, the battle was known as the Battle of Two Opponent Gods. I'm not even kidding. That's what they described it as. So in short, guys, he's a bird-headed god who's the creator of words, so we all know the bird is the word. And it is definitely Thoth, not Thought. Please know the difference. Anyways, guys, I want to thank you for watching another one of my crazy videos. If you like it, please give me a like. If you're new, please subscribe. I try to post videos at least once or twice a week. Uh, if you guys are big into gaming, I've got some gaming videos. And if you're more interested in mythology videos, I'll have a link for more of my mythology videos. And sometimes I just do random rants and raves on here. So if you guys like it, like I said, hit a like. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching and have a good rest of your time.